guys i hope you're all well i just wanted to do this vlog for like my first week of um as a pa student and i kind of missed out like first two days but i'm gonna vlog as much as i can as i go along so i'll just catch you guys up with what i did so far um so we had our like induction week where we got to like meet uh, our classmates uh, we did like some ice icebreaker games and got to know each other and so far it's been really nice but one thing that literally every single day we are reminded um, is that these two years are gonna be like really stressful these two years are gonna be a lot of work and they were just really stressing out like how we need to sort of maintain our mental health and how to manage stress so that's kind of like the vibe of what we did this week we're gonna have our first um lab today so i'm quite excited for that so um the other thing we did was yesterday they gave us like a chance to actually meet the second year pa students which was really nice because we got to ask them any questions they literally told us about their experience and how they passed exams Hey guys, so we just had our immunology lecture today and it was like just basic stuff and now we are off to for our lab which is in like a different campus so we're just like all walking we're gonna go and get some food So we just had our anatomy lecture so I'm just having some coffee to get myself to be awake because I'm actually so tired today. We have Ubaid here who's, <laughs> who's very camera shy so we won't put him but he's quite useless. We are just going, <laughs> going to the library now to get some work done hopefully and yeah we'll keep you updated. Okay. Hi. Hey. Um, my name is Myra Sajul. I'm one of the physician associate students. Um, can I start by taking your name? Yeah. Uh, my name is Khadiza. And what your full name, please? Khadiza Ali Akbar. And your date of birth? 22nd February 2000. Okay, brilliant. What brings you here today? Um, so I've been having these issues like I have headaches every day and it's been getting worse over time. Mm -hmm. <laughs> the right side of my head has been like really hurting a lot. Mm -hmm. The right side? Um, yeah. <laughs> Is there anything that you do that brings up the pain? or Not really, it's just so random. Like sometimes I get them and then sometimes I don't. But over time it's just been getting worse. Fine. Um, okay, have you been taking any pain relief for this? So I, I have been um, taking paracetamol mm -hmm. but then it's not being like, effective. So it's not, it's not working? No. Um, do you have any allergies no. to any medication just if we needed to prescribe you anything? No. Which we can't do. <laughs> <laughs> so why has it taken you four months to come to the doctors? <laughs> Excuse me. <don't> <laughs> no, my GP asks me. Hey guys, so I just wanted to catch you guys up with what has been happening with my week. We've kind of started doing cardiac system this week, so it's been quite a lot of work, not gonna lie, like in one day we did pharmacology, cardiac, anatomy, and I feel like it's just the beginning of the week and stuff are already piling up, but you know what, we'll get through it. So yeah, yesterday I stayed at the library for quite some time, got some work done, it's been quite nice. What I'm trying to do um, right now is, um, so thanks to the fact that we actually got to speak to um, second year PA students, which was so helpful, like Alhamdulillah for that, um, I kind of figured out how I want to do my sort of notes and how I want to go about revising my lectures so I've been doing like flashcards inside good notes um, in my iPad right and I do my notes and then I make them into flashcards um, and then I kind of like try and test myself um, oh yeah another thing I, I liked is what we're doing right now uh, with my friends in the library we try and sort of practice a bit of OSCEs we were practicing um, you know, a scenario where I was the patient and my friend, she was the physician associate. Um, it was a bit of a mess, but it's okay because we are learning. I think that's the whole point. Over time, you're going to keep practicing it so much uh, with each other that 
we can hopefully sort of become natural at it. So the other thing that's really nice what we did yesterday was um, practice how we are going to go about introducing ourselves to the patient when we encounter them. So um, I think that's really important because your introduction and how you sort of present yourself um, really makes a big difference and it gives out the impression that, you know, first impression that the patient has of you. Um, so yeah, uh, we practice that. Uh, I didn't know there were so many important things, even when you're trying to introduce yourself, that you really need to think about. Like, <clears throat> for example, I would always make the mistake uh, of saying, oh, yeah, I'm a PA student. Um, but you have to genuinely say, I'm a physician associate student. Like, small things like that can make a huge difference. Um, but yeah, it was nice. <laughs> <clears throat> like sort of learning how everyone would introduce themselves and practicing out loud just how I would introduce myself to a patient um, was really good. Oh, hey guys! Hey, can we someone are... just tell me the answer? Oh my god, god this yeah, yeah, what's wrong with you? <laughs> so we are on our way to the oh, yeah. lab, ECG lab right now. This is her first lab. <laughs> yeah. My first lab. I had COVID last yeah. week, guys. I had COVID. It's but she's yeah. recovered, alhamdulillah. 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 So the lab anatomy was actually quite fun. I loved it. I love practicals. I love like doing things, being active, but I wasn't able to, we are not allowed to record things because you know, um, you're not allowed to have your phone out in the labs. So that's quite sad, but I can tell you guys, it's a lot of fun. Like the, actually just learning off slides and learning off through lectures is a completely different experience to genuinely like be able to, for example, be like, see the things yourself like the parts of the arm legs and that way you can genuinely see the bones as well like we we were able to touch them i know it's just like basic things but i feel like that makes a huge difference lab work is always fun i love it Hey guys, so it's like 6 o'clock now and we're still doing our notes for tomorrow and so I got really hungry even though we already ate today and we ended up ordering the same thing we had yesterday You didn't even want to spend the money <laughs> You didn't even want to spend the money I was the support buddy that's true that's oven. true very true guys so, all right guys, i got the same food again oh my god like how good does that look how is it yeah it tastes very bland oh that's because this Bobby. girl flipping got covid and she got no taste yeah. but it's actually really good guys i got the what did i get quarter naga so it's quite spicy King corn. yeah this looks nice uh, rice. So today we are in the other campus. We just and Myra decided to get us breakfast. Look at her. <laughs> okay, guys. So we are literally still walking to our campus. Why? And that, well, I kind of got them in the wrong campus, guys. But it's okay because uh, we found our way. Oh, inshallah. Hopefully we do. Inshallah. But apparently we are not even in the Queen Mary campus. It's like literally. A whole it's been 20 minutes we are walking yeah. no we walked to our bar went to farrington so <laughs> exactly we could have literally got on got off at farrington but it's okay pray for us that we find our way through and actually get to the lecture on time we could have just cut straight through there because paul's bakery my patient for the day. So we already know that you're just 100 and um, so I'm going to go up to 400, 148 from before, okay? Alright, so because we have already done it, 148, we're gonna go up to 148, yeah. Yeah. You wanna make sure we can hear? Yeah. We can. Let me tell you. You alright? Okay. Let me tell you, I heard exactly the same thing you said. Around 100 and 
120 is when I had a and then here, what is that, 70. So guys, how was your experience it's in rubbish. being a PA? I can't hear anything <laughs> at all. So should we use the stethoscope for the first day and yeah. Mara couldn't, couldn't hear anything. anything. I couldn't hear anything. What about Maria you? was dead. We couldn't even find her artery. <laughs> so um, she had no heartbeat. Well, yeah. with Ubaid, it wasn't too well, bad. At the beginning, now, I so couldn't hear anything. But then yeah, no, I found my way through Maria it. I actually recorded my whole thing. What she about you? Alive. She came alive afterwards, so, so it's fine. She, All right, I had a really good. nice experience, actually. Yeah, that's I was, very good. Yeah, we had a well. nice session. It was just you guys. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Look who we've got here that oh, came to our uni. How was your first experience in um, Queen Mary? A lot of um, um, small boys. <laughs> small boys. Uh, we just got some bubble tea. How are you guys liking it? How, do you like it? Yeah, she's obsessed with bubble tea. She's got some next level addiction. It's quite a worry. <laughs> So guys, I can't believe we are leaving uni at 9. This is the life. We just started the course, yeah? <laughs> and we are leaving uni at 9. We're already behind, okay? Exactly. Imagine what's going to happen at the end of the course. What time are we going to leave by then? We're not even going to leave. We're going to leave here. <laughs> Literally. So we just had the most productive lecture ever. Like, <laughs> no, we learned so much about writing skills. Wow. You know, I actually fell asleep the whole time. I was, I was doing my ECG notes in that lecture. <laughs> Okay, so today we had a really lovely Juma, didn't we? Yes. We had a Kutba. What was the Kutba about? I don't Do you want to tell us? <laughs> well, Ubaid had an uh, interesting fan. So, <laughs> he has fans. He thinks he's famous now, guys. Someone gassed him and now he's like flying too high. Myra, how did you find that Juma? The Juma was lovely, lovely. lovely. You it know what? So nice. Ubaid is such a nice like Muslim community. So, I really, really enjoyed it. Yeah. How about you, Marzana? How did you find that? It was just sweet, I think, like telling people yeah. to be, you know, we shouldn't be alone, we should actually stay with each other, I guess. Yeah, and there's so many people that came. Together. Yeah, there's so many girls that came, so that was nice. Mm -hmm. Loved it. So we are now getting brunch after so long. The food looks good. How is it? It's actually a lot of food, so that's good. 